Okay, second grade, once you have uh, finished coloring your heart, and again, the most important part is doing the top and the edges. If you had time to do the back, uh, wonderful. If you did not, don't worry about it. We are going to turn all of these white detail lines into black detail lines, and how we're going to do that is we're going to be using black paint. So this year, our dispenser looks a lot like a ketchup dispenser for a picnic. And right now, it's facing upward. If it's facing upside down for too long, it'll start spilling everywhere. So we want to make sure that when we're done using it, the nozzle is facing up. Next to our paint cup is our little clear cups. And these are going to be what you'll be using uh, to fill up your paint so you'll turn it upside down and you'll just give it a small squeeze you only need a small amount you don't need to fill the cup up halfway or all the way just a small amount will do if you have extra left over we'll leave it for the next student if you run out you can always come back over and get more so with your brush we'll dip dip just the tip We'll spin the brush so it doesn't drip. Again, we do not want paint getting up onto our brush because once it gets onto our handle, it gets onto our hands. Once it gets onto our hands, it gets everywhere. We don't want paint getting inside of the brush. That's what causes the hairs to start falling out. So you're going to paint it a lot like you would a piece of paper, but before you pull and lift, you want to take that dab of paint and you want to gently dab it in to all of your cracks. And then you can pull lift, pull lift, pull lift, pull lift. If all you do is just pull lift, pull lift, pull lift, you can see right now that we're not getting into the cracks at all. So again, dip, dip, just the tip turn and spin so it doesn't drip and you want to dab in to the grooves and the cracks from the spirals and once your brush starts to dry out then you can go ahead pull lift pull lift pull lift Okay, second grade, once you have painted the top and it looks like you've covered all of the top very well and you don't see any white or any color, what we're going to do is with a paper towel, we can set our brush off to the side. We can move our heart off to the side. And if there's any paint on the table, you can go ahead and get a wet paper towel and you can wipe it down. You can leave your paint cup right next to you because we're not done with it. And while we're waiting for it to dry, you can go ahead and you can grab an Art for Kids Hub. You can work on a drawing. As you're working on the drawing, keep checking your clay. When the clay is finally dry, then you'll take your Art for Kids picture, move it off to the side, and you're going to go over your clay heart a second time. 